Last but not least, planting trees and shrubs help with all of these suggestions because they conserve water, keep water clean, and minimize runoff. Runoff is water that flows off of parking lots, roads, or other pavement, and it can be a big problem in urban areas. Water that runs off too quickly can cause flooding and other problems. Let's talk a little bit more about runoff and take a look at this graphic from the Arbor Day Foundation because it shows how trees help cities and urban areas deal with runoff. Treeless parking lots are unsightly, add to stormwater runoff, and are a source of heat that's not only uncomfortable, but increases air pollution. Streets without trees deprive the community of social benefits and ecological services. Asphalt playgrounds are unnatural places for children to play, contributing to a disconnect with nature. The solid surface also prevents rain from slowly recharging the groundwater. Treeless homes and yards reduce property values, increase energy costs, and allow rainfall to rush into gutters. Erosion-prone rivers eat away at adjoining property, destroying fish habitat and fill in reservoirs and waterways with silt. Compacted lawns without trees are not only less appealing, they often can't soak up heavy rains fast enough. Excessive runoff flows across sidewalks and down driveways and streets. Overwhelmed sewage systems can lead to untreated sewage being swept right into waterways. But trees can make a huge difference on this landscape, as you can see. Well landscaped parking lots can be designed to slow storm runoff and beautify the community. They cool parked cars, reduce evaporated gasoline that contributes to air polluting ozone. Tree shade also adds to the longevity to paved surfaces. Tree-lined streets retain large amounts of rainfall. They reduce and cleanse runoff. They can also increase property values, encourage shopping and businesses, reduce air pollution, calm traffic, and lower noise levels. Nature classrooms at schools can be combined with nearby community gardens and natural areas to serve as neighborhood parks. Their unpaid surfaces increase rainwater retention as they provide nature-rich play and learning spaces for children. Shaded homes and tree-filled yards make urban life more pleasant and provide practical benefits such as lower heating and air conditioning costs. The tree canopy is also a major contributor to stormwater runoff reduction. Riparian buffers consisting of trees and shrubs along waterways slow floodwaters, reduce erosion, cool the water for fish, and filter harmful runoff from adjoining lands. Rain gardens hold water on site, reducing wasteful runoff and providing moisture for tree roots and flower beds. They also filter chemicals draining from walks, driveways, and streets. Stormwater runoff that is manageable results from abundant trees, multi-use catch basins and rain gardens, reduced impervious surfaces, and increased ground vegetation. The benefits are lower costs and a more livable, sustainable environment. Yeah, what a difference urban and community forestry can make in cities and neighborhoods.